Hi and welcome to another video of Victor tutorial series. This video is the continuation of the previous video. In this video we are going to learn how to create a python3 package recipe that are not already available in our layers. So in previous video we learned two methods to add the python3 package into our image. It was from the existing layer and the other was from the meta python but if you don't have the package available in both of them then we have to create our own recipe so in this video we are going to see how to find the python3 package then how to which recipe creating tool we are going to use how to give the license to the package and how to add and test them into our system or how to integrate them into our system so first of all i want to add a gpio package in our image so now first of all let us look if we have that gpio package bit pick layers show recipes grab python 3 grab gpio show recipes I guess so you can see that this GPIO recipe package recipe is not available so first of all we have to look that where can we find this GPIO recipe for that we need to go to PyPL. So here, first of all, we go, we are going to search if there's any recipe available for the GPIO. So we're going to look GPIO, and here you can see that we have GPIO 1.0, GPIO 3, then GPIO 4. So I'm going to select this GPIO 3. So if we don't have normally we can use this command to install this in our system, but in our Yocto image, we don't have if let us say we don't have FIP and we don't have any other internet connection so how can we are going to integrate it or how we are going to install this to do this to create the recipe there is an open source tool it's a very good tool that we can use the name of the tool is in the google you can write pip to bitpick and the first link you're going to open so here the first link it is used to create the python3 package recipe for that the prerequisites are that you should have this python pip install if you have if you don't have this python pip if you are using ubuntu you can use this command to install and if you are using send os then you can use this command to install but i have already installed so first of all let me clone this to clone we are going to copy this link and after that we are going to our here in this folder in my workspace I'm going to clone it so it's a git clone and the so I have cloned it successfully so to run this we need a couple of things what we need is first of all we need the name of the package so the name of the package is gpio3 after that we need the license so license you can see that here is the license so these two things are important so now let us begin to run this we have to go inside pip to big folder here is a python 3 and make recipes.py make pip recipes.py we have to run so it says that name of the package the name of the package is and it also says that you can find the package here so, so our name of the package is gpio3 so it is here if you see like this it is here just gpio3 then we uh, let me show you I, I think uh, you haven't seen yeah it is here 
yeah i think you 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 missed this part uh, so i i'm going to show this again so let me cancel this so i'm inside like right now in the pip2 folder or let me remove this first and i will clone it once more so i will clone uh get clone and write like this like this now i'll go inside here and then i will do python 3 and make recipes.py so now it says that name of the package i have shown you the name of the packages gpio3 now it says which for the which version of the python so we are doing it for python 3 so we'll select say 3 and after that the name of the license so the license i have shown you here if you look uh here's the license this is lgpl vt i will copy this here and i am going to paste it here okay so now it is creating a package ah, my password okay it says the package has been created so it has created a pip gpio package if you see here it is here pip gpio package so now let us look first of all at this package code pip gpio so here's the package so it has automatically fetched the source and the license and the version and the package name everything it did automatically so now we have to move this to our layers so the layer is i will put it here it inside a meta tab layer and here i will create recipes recipes python 3 packages so inside recipes python 3 packages i will create a folder gpio 3 i would say and here inside gpio 3 i will copy so the rest the path and after copying the paths what i'll do is i'll come back here and i'll paste the path here so for cp so in the pip but here i am going to rename this instead of pi pip gpio i'm going to write it python or first of all let me copy it here as it is now we have it here so i will rename it pip2 python3 so it has been renamed successfully now we are going to add it into our image in local.conf do it gpio so it is gpio and uh, save it and now we'll build the image bit big core image full command line it is building right now python gpio3 package for us the image has been built successfully now we will test the image and we will see if we have this gpio or not 
So now I am inside our boat and now let us run Python 3 and then we'll do help and now we'll do what use let us look for the python 3 oh not python 3 gpio so we should have it here yes you see that now we have the gpio 3 in our python available to use so this is how we can create a recipe of a package that does not exist but uh, this pip to bitpig also have some exceptions and i will talk about those exceptions in the next video i hope you like the video please like and subscribe my channel and thanks for watching see you next time